Hello, hello, and welcome to our little path. My name is Amanda, if you are new here. Today, I am going to be reviewing, renewing, reviewing, uh, every sacred Sunday, and it is a Sunday mass journal. So if that's something you're interested in, we begin. I just want to remind you, if you have not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button below, as well as hitting the notification bell button, because every time I post, you will be notified with new videos. I would love for you to join me, and uh, if you could answer the question of the day for me is, do you journal during Mass? Do you read the scripture before Mass? Um, the weekly Sunday readings. If you don't, this may be very helpful for you. I tend to watch Bishop Barron's homily before Mass on Sundays, and I try to read the uh, readings as well ahead of time because kids sometimes are distracted. So, like to go in a little prepared if I can. All right, let me know what you guys do. You are in my way. Yeah, no, no, nobody wants to see you right there or hear you. No one. Okay, so we are going to be discussing every sacred Sunday. And this is a company that has mass journals. They have the readings for every Sunday, as well as like a section, which I will show you to um, kind of journal either during mass or before mass about the readings of the week. Now, this is a company I actually have followed since I think their Kickstarter and I hadn't bought from them yet, but I kept seeing them over the past, I think they're like maybe four years old, five years old. Um, and it's something that's always intrigued me, but I was a little nervous uh, about having, like bringing something to church. But our kids have been bringing like kind of books, mass journals to church the last past few months, and they've been really liking it. And I know that I would like something. So that um, kind of prompted me to gift this as my early maybe Christmas gift. And I actually have two because I bought some for my parents as well for their Christmas gifts. So they will get Christmas a little bit early. Um, which I let them know and they were super happy about. So <laughs> I have both colors, exact same book. I'm gonna go ahead and open it, unbox it with you guys, and then we can kind of do a little look through as well. Um, I will unbox both colors just so you can see, but I think both box contents are the exact same thing. And obviously the books besides the color are the exact same thing. So let's jump in. I'm gonna unbox the one that's gonna be mine. Are you gonna say hi? Hi. Okay. Go on ahead. <laughs> so I'm going to unbox the one that I'm gonna keep just so that I can kind of get it all out of the way. I love that the boxes are like a sturdy box. You could actually keep the book in here to kind of keep it protected. It is a hard covered book as well. Um, and then it says, welcome to the ESS fam. And they have a bunch of little goodies in here. So they have a bunch of facts about every sacred Sunday, the company. And then in here, they have, let's see if I can get it out. So they have a really beautiful print here. And then they have a little psalm card, which I think would make as a nice like uh, bookmark. They have a sticker, and then I think on here somewhere they have like a, um, oh, they have like free resources. So I think they have like a liturgical calendar as well, um, and some other paperwork tips. Everyone is awake. I am not filming during quiet time right now. So, <laughs> all right, can you go take that over there, please? I have someone who was sneaking behind as well and hasn't popped her head over yet. There we go. All right. Hi. <laughs> so. Hi. Mom work, please. Thank you. Okay. So they have, oh, they do have a silk ribbon bookmark. This has a little bit more details in the cover about the book. So I'm going to go ahead and unwrap this since this one is going to be mine. Um, I got the pink and it's actually, oh, 
you're gonna see my outside there. Uh, I'll unwrap it so it doesn't reflect. This has a really light, beautiful, like gold design on it. Um, it's kind of like a stained glass with wheat on it. So it's really beautiful. And we'll do a look through so that you guys can see. It's like a nice linen hardback cover. And then they have all of the like prayers for the um, mass. So you can follow along at the beginning. Here we are going into year C. So it starts with Advent, which is really nice, um, which is why my parents are gonna get there is a little early. <clears throat> and then it goes through your table of contents. I'll do a look through, but um, it is really beautiful. The weight of the paper is really nice. And then um, basically it starts off with, so it starts off and it has your readings here, which is really nice to follow. And then it gives you a place to journal, whether that's journaling before mass, after mass, during the homily, if the priest is writing down anything that's, or saying anything that's speaking to your heart that week. Um, and it goes through throughout, throughout the whole year. Now, what I was kind of surprised about is how small it is. I don't know why, but like I was thinking a year's worth of Sunday masses sounds like a lot of writing, but it's actually pretty small. Like I could definitely fit this in my purse. Um, if you're like me, most moms, you have like a decent sized purse. So um, I can fit this in my purse easily. And I like that it's hardback too. So throughout the year, it's going to definitely hold up. It's not gonna be um, you know, tearing the covers and things like that. So, um, I'm super excited to utilize this this year and, um, hopefully it will be a good way to kind of reflect on each Sunday. Cause I think as moms or as parents, we often lose, uh, some of that like connection during church if we're wrangling little kids. So um, hopefully this will kind of help bring back that connection as well um, and that focus, whether it's directly during the mass or something that I can do before or after each Sunday. So I'm gonna jump in. Oh, let me show you what the blue looks like. So before we jump in. So the blue is like a little bit more masculine, obviously. Still has the wheat um, on the front of it. I've got kids standing around trying to see the color as well. So obviously this is wrapped, so it's kind of shiny right now, but it's just like a navy blue, still has the linen um, hardback cover, and it's really beautiful as well. Nice and simple, very understated. Is it very beautiful, very understated, um, and I am excited to utilize it this year. I don't obviously have like a full review because I haven't utilized it yet, but let's go ahead and switch into the look through. Okay, so we have the cover here. Again, that gold is like, it's there. It's just very light. Here they have all of the prayers um, during the mass to reference. They have a little intro here and then the table of contents. Now they do have um, little reflections at the start of some of the seasons, which is really cool. There's a forward here. And then they have the how to use the journal, tips to pray with strict scripture. And then here they have a start of the year reflection. They have a color coding for each of the seasons. And then you can see that color coding reflected at the top of these pages here. And they have various artwork by the um, creators of Every Secret Sunday throughout. So here they have a little intro to Advent. And then you go into your Sunday readings with your reflections. So scripture speaks, weekly intentions, any notes, and anything to go forth with. And let's see if we can find. So here, oh look, they had a post-advent reflection. That's pretty cool. And then 
here they have the Christmas time. And they give you all the different varieties of masks as well. So these are all the Christmas masks, mass at dawn, mass during the day. So you should be able to get your reading selection that your priest chooses for whichever mass that you are at. And then artwork, just really beautiful. So here's some lint with the reflection. So pretty, pretty standard, pretty basic, nothing too crazy um, with it. And then let's see what they have at the back of the book. They have just some general notes section, end of the year reflection, and then different prayers as well that maybe not necessarily mass related but there for you to pray during Mass as you want as well. So that is it. It does come with the bookmark as well, which is really nice. So you can keep your um, part of the, or keep your day of the week bookmarked. <clears throat> and there it is. So let me know if you guys have any more questions about it. I'm excited to utilize it and hopefully we can kind of maybe do like a, mid-year update on how it's going. All right, I hope you guys have a great day. And again, let me know if you have any more questions in the comments below. Bye. Bye. What? Really? Go lay down. I just took you.